yeah, baby, Arizona World Champion back here again with another rant video. It sort of dawned on me why I didn't like that AVGN movie as much as I thought I would. You know, it's still a cool movie. It was fun seeing all the different action scenes. Yeah, what's bugging me about the film, and I think it's bugging a lot of people too, is that Here's this movie about the nerd, it's about, you know, 90 minutes and all, and you're introduced to all these new characters, like, uh, you got this, uh, you know, strange hot new cameraman that seems to be following him around, and you got this guy in a tank for some reason, and this giant monster, and, you know, you're not used to seeing this stuff when you see angry nerd videos, no, you're used to seeing Mike Matei, Kyle Justin, Lloyd Cochran, <laughs> just all these different characters you've seen in his previous hundred videos and all that, and you want to see more of the nerd himself, but <laughs> it just goes off topic sometimes, and yeah, that brings me to this whole Irate Gamer discussion again. <laughs> Alright, here we go. I know it's like a month old since I made those two other videos, but I still have a lot of unanswered questions myself because. Hey, I knew there was going to be a lot of haters on those videos saying, Oh, you got all your fats wrong. Why are you hating on Chris? And that sort of <laughs> bullshit that I usually hear in those videos. But again, if you hate it, refute my arguments. I got a lot of cool comments, you know, from a lot of, you know, intelligent YouTubers out there like Sinus Destroyer, the LJN Defender, you know, Benevolent Dick. <laughs> they know their stuff. And they sort of grew up on this whole controversy too, like was Ira Gamer, you know, stealing James Rolfe's ideas back then, you know, <laughs> when Ira Gamer wasn't admitting that he did actually steal content. It was such a huge deal. Why would you not mention that you <laughs> lit the material? Because I remember other people that entered the contest, like, the person that actually won, Happy Video Game Nerd, he mentioned that, yeah, he got his inspiration from James Rolfe. <laughs> you can pretty much see it in all his videos that, hey, I got this idea from James Rolfe. And, you know, it was no big deal. And he won the contest, and his videos are informative and all that. And, okay, I'm pretty much saying the same old stuff I was saying in the previous videos, but. It begs repeating because I still don't have any real answers because if you go to Chris's channel, he made that video about a month ago and I was hoping already maybe we could get like update video but if you go to his channel it's all just like Skylander videos. I still don't understand why he has to go to the route of saying that old James left the content from me so he's not really a good guy himself and Oh, the tables are turning, so to speak. Oh, but, hey, it's still like a good topic for like a natural sequel to the Angry Video Game Nerd movie. Chris and James can sort of bury the hatchet, so to speak, and see if they can make the <laughs> uh, all new Angry Video Game Nerd movie where they can go behind the scenes of, you know, the back and forth jabbing and the old bat talk and everything like that because there is a cool story there <laughs> ah, that would be amazing but I don't think it'll ever fucking happen <laughs> yeah imagine Chris Bors and the angry video game nerd <laughs> sharing film together trying to get along ah, yeah the reason why I think Chris Bors really wants to start a feud with the Angry Video Game Nerd and saying that his contest was raided and uh, he stole material from me and I'm really mad. The reason why he's bringing all this stuff up to begin with is because he wants a scandal. <laughs> yeah, if you watch Chris Bohr's Super Mario Bros. 2 review, it's a scandal. It's controversial. It's something that you haven't seen before. Watch, watch, watch. Okay, it wasn't a perfect video or anything like that, but it got the job done. It got featured on YouTube. He got really popular. And that scandal that he created really helped elevate his career. 
And that's what he's trying to do with the feud with the Angry Feel game there. He's trying to create a scandal. Ooh, look at what James Rolfe is doing. Isn't it so bad? Isn't it so evil? Ooh, don't you just hate that guy? Buy Christian, you know. Please don't hate him. <laughs> I just think it would be so cool if they actually did a movie together. <laughs> the Angry Reveal Game Nerd Movie 2, Irate Gamer Scandal, or whatever. That's what I would like to see in the Angry Reveal Game Nerd Movie. <laughs> I'd like to see how he actually got started in his whole career and not just some made up E.T. digging through the desert sort of crap where you got all these different fictional characters and sometimes it doesn't make a lot of sense and you're trying to exaggerate things with this crazy alien with the jack and jaw and everything. No, I don't want to see that. When YouTube was just starting up and you guys were the biggest names on YouTube because I remember those days and a lot of other people do and there's a great story there but there's so much like hurt feelings and I don't know maybe if the two parties can get talking I think it would make a great movie and that's just my two cents just another crazy Ivory Gamer versus AVG and video you know but maybe this will be the one that actually made them come together and do a new video and do a new movie <laughs> probably not okay and that's it for me this is Arizona World Heavyweight Champion over and out